With just over a month of summer break left, Arkansas school districts are still figuring out what school will look like. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Craig O'Neill and Marlisa Goldsmith will join us later from her home. The Pulaski County Special School District released its plan for reopening and as TSP 11's Melissa Zigowitz shows us, parents and students will have options. I mean, obviously what we're dealing with right now is um, so much unknown. The Pulaski County Special School District is leaving the decision to go back to in-person classes up to parents. We are offering three options. Parents can choose between traditional five days a week in a classroom, a blended option with two days in school and three days at home online or 100% virtual. We needed to know that uh, having options for our parents uh, would be so important. Spokesperson Jessica Duff says face masks will be required for staff and expected for students. Students will not be disciplined for not wearing one, but if they choose not to, Duff recommends parents choose the virtual option. Hopefully parents have been working with their kids during this time to explain to them about face coverings and the importance of it. The Arkansas Department of Education will be providing school employee screening kits for every school in the state. Each kit will include a thermometer, masks, and gloves. They'll kind of be the lead to help with the screening process and temperature checks at the beginning of each school day. Duff asks parents to be patient with the district as they continue to sort out plans. Everyone wants answers, but unfortunately we don't have all of the answers right now, but we're working diligently to get information out to parents. Now parents will have until Friday, July 24th to figure out how they want to send their kids back to school this year. Reporting from Little Rock, Melissa Zigowitz, THV 11 News.